Hi, my name is Kathy Wilson. I'm the department chair for the economics department at Kent State. And thanks for stopping by to hear a little bit about the data analytics minor. So even though the data analytics minor is housed within the economics department, it's a really versatile minor that can be added to virtually any major throughout the university across a lot of different colleges within Kent State. Our goal for the students in the data analytics minor is that you're going to be able to be skilled at acquiring, cleaning, and using data no matter what career field you're in. So the curriculum focuses on five areas. There's a statistics course. Likely you might be able to use a statistics course that's already within your major and count it towards both the major and the minor. Once you do a computer programming course, because we think it's really important that you understand the logic in computer programming, there's a data acquisition, preparation, and visualization course. It teaches you how to clean data, how to do some kind of cool data visualization tools. There's two econometric courses. These are basically advanced statistical courses that help you to understand what methods and what data you might be able to use in different situations and how to use those methods correctly. And then finally, there's an elective course, and that's a course preferably within your major where data is used. We're continuing to expand the possible electives to fit with many majors throughout the university. In the course of this curriculum, you're going to learn a lot of different software packages. And one of the advantages of learning multiple software packages is it's important because you'll graduate probably knowing the software package that your employer wants you to use. But more importantly, because you're learning multiple different programming languages or different software packages, you're going to be able to have that knowledge to learn whatever the next software breakthrough is once you're off in your career. So it's not just preparing you to start, but preparing you so that you can continue to develop as software and technology changes. One of, the key, um, one of the keys for data analytics minor is not just that you can use software, but more importantly, that you know what methods to use in order to best use the data to answer the question before you. So another advantage that we really focus on within the minor is for you to be able to communicate about the data, telling the story through data visualization, through writing about the data, or through spoken presentations. Even though this is a relatively recent minor, the data analytics minor has proven to be really attractive to, um, to employers. So students who have minored in data analytics recently have gone on to be data analysts at Bloomberg LP in the financial sector, a financial analyst for medical mutual in the healthcare sector, a pricing analyst at progressive insurance in the insurance sector, a business pricing analyst at Pella Corporation. A ma uh, major corporations are always looking for data analysts. The thing that's most important to me is to understand that the data analytics minor is a natural minor to add if you're in any field of business, but also if you're in public health, nursing, aeronautics, geography, sociology, computer science, political science, many more majors. If you're in a major where using data can be helpful within that major, then the data analytics minor is going to be really good to pair with that major. So no matter what college or major you're in, if you want to be able to use data to solve problems within that major, the data analytics minor is something you should check out. I would absolutely love to talk with you more about the minor and how the minor might fit into your academic plans. Just email me at kwilson3 at kent.edu or look at the data analytics um, minor at the, at the Department of Economics webpage. Um, I look forward to getting a chance to talk with you more about it. Thank you.